This podcast is brought to you by Renewal by Anderson of Central Pennsylvania. Save $400 on every window and $800 on every entry and patio door from now until August 31st. You'll even get a free upgrade to Renewal Smart Sun Glass to keep your home even more comfortable in the heat. Visit rbacentralpa.com slash deals or call 717-727-7558 to get on this deal now. A man who threatened to detonate a bomb at Music Fest has been arrested. Meanwhile, the PUC has agreed to a revised settlement over an explosion that occurred in 2019. There's been a noticeable spike in homeschooling interest. And Eagles fans meet popcorn for the people. I'm Claudia DeMiro, and you're listening to Today in a PA. A Bethlehem man has been accused of threatening to build and detonate an explosive at Music Fest, reports Lehigh Valley Live. Cops received information on Thursday from quote-unquote community members of what Robert Bowen Jr. was planning to do during the annual festival. He was arrested and arraigned on Friday and faces charges including unlawful possession or manufacture of a weapon of mass destruction. Authorities were able to find homemade explosives as part of the investigation and additionally were able to link Bowen to at least three other incidents in and around Bethlehem where someone detonated firework-sized devices. However, Northampton County Judge Sam Murray decided to seal the probable cause affidavit due to the sensitivity of the investigation, which is still active. The Public Utility Commission approved a revised settlement with a gas utility over a 2019 explosion that reduced a house to rubble and injured five people in North Franklin Township, reports the Associated Press. Columbia Gas, which is based out of Cannonsburg, took responsibility for the blast, stating it had failed to install a key piece of equipment while workers upgraded a nearby gas main at the time. The commission this past December rejected an earlier proposed settlement that had been reached with Columbia, claiming they wanted more info about the extent of the damage, its cost, and which steps the company had taken as preventative measures against such incidents in the future. As of last week, the PUC approved the resulting revised settlement, which now carries a $990,000 civil penalty that the utility can't recover from ratepayers. Surge interest in homeschooling spiked nationwide between 2019 and 2023, states PenLive. Age of Learning, which touts itself as, quote, a leading education technology innovator, published a study that leveraged data from the U.S. Census as well as relevant Google analysis to create said study and found that, in Pennsylvania, interest for homeschooling went up by 71 percent within that time period. The state with the highest interest spike was by far Connecticut, which saw a 128% jump. It's almost football season, believe it or not, says Philly Voice. And ahead of the impending season, the Eagles Autism Foundation has announced that fans coming to Lincoln Financial Field this year will be offered a special treat. A new popcorn stand at the stadium will hire adults with autism and intellectual disabilities to cook, prepare, and package popcorn bags during games and other events. The stand is born of a partnership with nonprofit Popcorn for the People, which creates employment opportunities for those with such disabilities as a means to reduce the unemployment rate among them. Says Eagles owner Jeffrey Leary via press release, quote, This transformational partnership is a prime example of what can be accomplished when organizations with aligned missions come together. That wraps up today's episode. For even more news, visit penlive.com. And please remember to rate this podcast wherever you may listen to it and to share it around. Thanks ahead of time. And as always, thanks for listening. I'm Claudia DeMiro, and I'll be back again tomorrow for another round of Today in a PA. This podcast is brought to you by Renewal by Anderson of Central Pennsylvania. Save $400 on every window and $800 on every entry and patio door from now until August 31st. You'll even get a free upgrade to Renewal Smart Sun Glass to keep your home even more comfortable in the heat. Visit rbacentralpa.com slash deals or call 717-727-7558 to get on this deal now.